Seemed like a lot of players were saying, just couldn't finish off those shots. You know, you felt like you were hit, getting some of them, just couldn't finish off those shots. What do you think really was the big stumble block for you guys not to finish off those shots? Yeah, we just we weren't playing complimentary football to the defense. Defense played great all day, put us in a lot of um, opportun opportunities to uh, you know put the game away. But um, one thing is for certain, can't turn the ball over. You know, obviously, you know I, I take. Uh, Proud in that myself, especially being a back in this league. You know, you get touch the ball; it's a privilege. So, in any given situation, no matter how far you go, no matter the situation, you gotta, you know, take care of the ball. We had what two turnovers today? You know, that was a difference in the game. So, um, you know, even Coach Harborough even mentioned earlier, the message would have been the same regardless if we would have won or lost. You know, it was all all about a learning experience this game, um, making sure that you know three and zero and two and one in the grand scheme of the entire season. Um, as long as we continue to uh, progress and become a team we know we can, you know, we're capable of becoming in the long run, then uh, that's the ultimate goal. Kevin, you mentioned the turnovers, you had the one um, where you got both from behind. Was, was the ball wet? Was it surprise you what kind of happened? There? No, I just have to be a, a more aware of my surroundings in that situation, regardless of, you know, if I have my eye on the end zone, if I'm running through a, a, a traffic, you know, crowd of people, uh, you know. The uh, entire team, the entire city is, you know, depending on me when I had that ball in my hand and e each and every one of us when we have the ball in our hands. So, um, you know, just got to move on through that. It was an early part of the game, try to make plays as the game went on, but, you know, got to, you know, learn from that and continue to grow. Kenny, was there a message in the team at halftime after the turnovers and everything? Um, not necessarily. I mean, at the end of the day, it's a, two, it's a game of uh, two halves. So, you know, we had to come in and make sure that, um, obviously, we didn't repeat that recipe because that was going to be a recipe of disaster. But at the end of the day, um, as long as we play complimentary football, defense plan, special teams, um, you know, we pick a, our, ourselves up on the offensive side, we're going to be successful. But you know, we, we weren't able to you know, finish that job at the end. You know, that's a lead. As, as a team, though, do you feel like this was one that just maybe just slipped away from you guys? That, that you guys, if you were on point, you might have, might have been a different result. Yeah, you know what I mean? I, and I hate, you know, hindsight is twenty twenty. At the end of the day, you can look back at different things and be like, you know, of course, if we did this, if we didn't do this, you know, the result would be different, but the result is a result. So we have to, you know, strap it on next week. You know, we got another a division, well, have a divisional opponent um, on an away game. So it's going to be a tough task to go and, you know, obviously get a win in any given situation, home or away. Uh, so we just got to uh, take the things that we can learn from, um, you know, play to our, our best capabilities and continue to, you know, move on. Any coaches speak to you after the fumble? Is there anything said? Uh, I mean, just play ball at the end of the day, you know. Uh, <laughs> the whole quote I used to say was, you know, it's not the first time or not the last time. Hopefully it is the last time, but at the end of the day, um, you just got to play ball. You can't, you can't allow something to, um, you know, take away your confidence to allow you to shell up and not be who you are. Just play ball and make plays for the team. Kenyon, how challenging was it to get up to speed? I mean, it is different coordinator, a little bit different mm -hmm. offense than it was last year, just yeah. coming in this week. Yeah, I mean, of course it was a challenge. Um, you know, certain things may mesh. I may think, you know, something was something else compared to what it is. But at the end of the day, they put me in the best position to be successful by putting me in specific plays. Now, you know, going into week two, open the playbook a little bit up for me. You know, I'm going to get more into the things that I know that I can continue to help this team win in whatever position that is. And, you know, I want to continue to do that.